What is going on guys? Gray here today. There's some big news came out for Battlefield 2042. Now this is leaked info, so take it with a grain of salt, but the year two leaked info for Battlefield 2042 on Origin. And I will link all the information about this down in the description if you want to look over it for yourself. But of course it was posted on Twitter and then of course they made a Reddit post about it as well. And it kind of just shows, you know, Battlefield 2042 year two upgrade. It's just kind of a placeholder name. Uh, a long text description placeholder text and a lot of people were really surprised to see this a lot of people were kind of curious exactly what was going to happen with the game uh, since we really haven't had any more info about another season after the current season we are in now i was expecting if the player base was staying pretty strong since the release of the game on game pass and now of course on playstation it being free as well i was assuming that they might look at that and if they're keeping a, a good bit of numbers, if they're keeping a good bit of players playing now that the game has been on sale a good bit too lately on PC, I was wondering if they were going to have a good bit of, uh, you know, the player base staying and playing and people coming back to play because now you have players on Xbox being able to play with a little bit easier access than having to buy the game since they have the Game Pass. Of course, PlayStation players are all downloading it for free for the month, uh, you know, or the, or this month, excuse me, but it looks like dice have had may already had this in the works i'm kind of surprised if they didn't um, i think they probably were looking to do something may have not decided completely just yet if they were going to you know do it or not but now that they see the player base is, is strong again uh they may have decided to just go ahead and go with the year two content i think it'll be great for the game i know a lot of people out there will be shocked to kind of see this and i think there's a lot of things they can do they've done great with the season so far and everything really in the game since season two has improved you know, a big improvement with season three and season four there's still improvements they can make don't get me wrong the game is definitely not perfect but they can do some things like add some new maps in some new weapons in of course some more portal stuff but I really do think they could add some old maps once again into the game. I think Operation Metro would be an absolute blast on this game. I think a lot of people would love to see that. But with things like that, I still would like to see new maps added in as well. Because I think just adding in old maps is not going to completely really make the player base happy. I think a mix of old maps and new maps would be a great thing. And if they would add at least two maps a season, I think that would be even better than just the one. Of course, like I said, new weapons. There's a lot of new things they can do. Now that we have the class system back, there's a lot of ways that they can you know, still tweak that and add things into each class. Not sure if we'll get any more operators. They said the last operator we got in Season 4 was going to be it. But there is still a few uh, you know, sections there like support uh, that probably could have another, uh, another character added in or at least rework the characters we have because now that we have the class system there's a few that stand out and there's a few that are not as good as they once were when we we're just you know kind of using them as specialists anyway guys leave me a comment with your thoughts let me know what you think and of course if you like the video hit the like if you have not subscribed yet please do so and i'll catch you next time peace